Hello everyone, Johnny Hurricane here from GamersHeroes.com and today we'll be going over which tower to pick, Tower of Water or Tower of Darkness, in Pokemon Sword and Shield Isle of Armor. Let's get started. Alright, so there are two choices as we said. Now basically what you're doing here is picking what your Cub Fu evolves into. While it looks the same, it evolves into Urshifu or Urshifu. Um, the extra element it gets is either water or darkness, depending on the tower. So that's up to you, really, if you want another water Pokemon, water fighting, or water, or no, water fighting Pokemon, or darkness fighting Pokemon, basically. As you fight your way up the tower, you will have to do five battles. These battles are not that difficult. I went in at level 95 because of my EXP candies. I think if you go in at like 80, you'll be okay. Because the top level Pokemon is level 80. Once you get to the top and you beat the Dojo Master Mustard, he will then tell you to look at the Scroll of Water or Scroll of Darkness. And whichever one you choose will evolve Cub Fu into Ursifu, which will then give him the second element. Uh, again, depending on which tower you pick. So it's up to you which one you want in your party. I already had Blast twice. I did not have a Darkness Pokemon, so it made it pretty simple for me. I wanted the Dark one. And here's what he evolves into. Again, he looks the same no matter which tower you pick. The only difference is in their giant form, their uh, Gigantamax forms, they are different colors. But anyways, that's what happens depending on which tower you pick. That just depends on what extra element your Urshifu gets. Anyways, if you liked what you saw, got what you needed, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Later, Gators.